Hey guys, it's 50 Huz and today we have got an amazing gameplay, honestly, amazing in capital letters with an exclamation mark at the end of it. This is an 80 and 0 gameplay. An 80 kill flawless gameplay. Oh my days. That is crazy. Anyway, this isn't my gameplay. It's gameplay from based that dude. His annotation would be on the screen. His link to his channel would be in the description. It would be on your bedroom window. It will be on your back of the trainers. It will be everywhere. So go and check out his channel. Be sure to check out his channel. He's from America. And I know I got a lot of subscribers from America. So if you want a fellow American commentator, be sure to check out his channel. Um, I highly appreciate it. And back in the day, I used to help out a lot of channels. Which is kind of weird, you would think a channel will help out smaller channels when they get bigger But I used to help out a lot of channels back in the day And I need to get back into it, so I will be taking in submissions for gameplays And uploading them here and there I got a few submissions for like 40 kill, 22 death domination I don't want gameplay like that, heck I could get gameplay like that myself on a dodgy connection So why would I upload that? Um, I want crazy gameplays, which you would expect from 50 Hz. Something like an 80 and 0, yes. I'm kind of criticizing myself, but I want to get gameplay like this. And it's crazy. It's crazy to watch. So hopefully you guys enjoy this. Um, a quick mention of his equipment. He's using the Scorpion gun, which he isn't using at the moment. I haven't used the Scorpion Evo gun myself. And his kill streaks, right? His kill streaks go absolutely kebab mode on this game. Forget going ham. This is kebab mode with chili sauce, salt and vinegar, ketchup, all of it on one. He's got the stealth chopper. He's got the warhog, I believe it's called. And he's got the lodestar. In the gameplay, I believe he gets lodestar three times. So he basically cycles through his kill streaks, which definitely helps and contributes in him getting 80 kills in hard point. And look at this, he comes out of his loadster, and the hard point was actually where he was. And that was so lucky, he nearly died. And that is the type of luck you need in order to get super high crazy scores like this. And another factor which really impressed me was, he was playing the objective. He finishes this game with the most captures and the most defense of the hard point. And that's what impresses me. Obviously in this game you get rewarded for playing the objective. So if you're one of those people who avoid the flags in domination, who avoid the hard point in hard point, play the objective and you will get your kill streaks while score streaks a lot easier. Now He's picked up this target finder, right? <laughs> and I'm not gonna lie, I tried this target finder on this particular map and it helps a lot. Because this map is so cluttered. There is so much rubbish on this map. And this map, right, it reminds me it reminds me of a map back in Call of Duty 4. It had hangars and there was tanks and it was really similar to this. And a lot of maps in this game remind me of maps from previous Call of Duties. For example, slums, the whole texture, the whole feel, the whole visual side of that map is just like Favela. Then there's a map called Raid. Raid, the map layout of Raid is just like Radiation from Call of Duty Black Ops. It's exactly the same. Um, there's another map. Um, what's the one on the boat? I can't remember the name of the boat one. That is just like Hotel, but in, in a more attractive fashion. The whole layout of that map is just like Hotel. It seems like they're just taking maps from all the Call of Duties and just changing how they look. But the layout of the map is exactly the same. And that's a really lazy job by Treyarch or whoever the hell makes these games. Activision, Treyarch, my mum, my dad, I don't even know. Um, he calls in another Lodestar, this is his last one. So just a reminder. For this epic gameplay, the least that you can do is drop this video a quick rating and more importantly, just check out his channel, check out a few of his videos. He's, a he's actually got quite a few gameplays on this particular map. Maybe it's his favourite map, I don't know. I'm not sure how this map could be someone's favourite map because it's horrendous. The only positive thing about this map is killstreaks will go to town. And also, he's on the Xbox. 
Everyone says people on PS3 are rubbish. All the highest gameplays I've seen are on Xbox. Now what does that say about Xbox plays? I don't know. Anyway, catch you next time guys. Check out his channel. Latest.